Hi, my name is Joel Solomon. I'm a prosperity coach, and my mission is to help at least 100,000 people become financially free. So welcome to rule number six, giving. This is from my upcoming book, The Nine Money Rules That Millionaires Use. Let me tell you a story from the chapter on giving. This is from a speech I gave at the Toastmasters Manhattan Area Contest, the winning speech I gave at the Toastmasters Manhattan Area Contest. Part of that speech talked about giving. And this is what I had to say about giving. No investor will ever talk to you about giving, but giving may be the quickest way to financial freedom. Giving creates karma. You reap what you sow. Sir John Templeton, who some consider the best investor of all time, said he hadn't met anybody who hadn't given at least 10% of his earnings to charities over a 10 year period who didn't have massively more wealth at the end of the 10 years than at the beginning. Now I know what some of you are thinking. Joel, if I give my money away, how do I have more money? I'm going to have less money, not more money. How does that work? Well, th let me explain. The reason is because money is energy. And the more you give, the more you open yourself up to receive. The more you put that energy out into the universe, sharing with others, the more that energy must come back to you. And the more you give, the more you create the belief in your ability to receive more. And by giving as little as 10%, you are creating belief that you're abundant and worthy and that there's plenty and more than enough to go around. And giving doesn't have to be just about money. You could give your time to those in need. You may have a special talent or gift. Why not share that with the world? You could give a smile or a compliment to a stranger. You could even give a speech at your Toastmasters club. Only by giving are you able to receive more than you already have. And I can tell you, when I started a giving program to the Food Bank of New York City, and I started doing five nice things a day, I felt I had plenty to spare and share. I felt more abundant. Now giving can indeed change the world, and I hope this speech does inspire someone to start. So that was the speech I gave. But let me continue with some quotes from my book. Sir John Templeton has also said that the secret of success is giving, not getting. Those who are grown up give, the immature do not. It is wise to practice giving in every area of your life. And Mike Dooley, who wrote the bestseller Infinite Possibilities says, by inviting the magic into your thoughts with gratitude and giving, thanks that what you want is already yours. Even though you don't physically see it yet, you prepare the way for unlimited withdrawals. And I continued with some quotes from the One, million, one mil, Minute Millionaire by Mark Victor Hansen and Robert G. Allen who discuss giving as expanding money. They state that just like water exists in three forms, ice, liquid, and vapor, we find it useful to think that money exists in three dimensions, the frozen state, material, the liquid state, mental, and the spiritual state. And when you give money from an attitude of gratitude and abundance, it thrusts you from the material state into the spiritual dimension. And then they go on to say that just like water expands when it's heated, money expands when it's given away. Given, giving literally magnifies, multiplies, and expen, exponentializes money. And they, this is how they conclude, by saying that the enlightened millionaire knows that giving money actually expands in the spiritual dimension. 100% times 10 is a thousand percent. This is spiritual math. And tithing is a money multiplier, not a money subtractor. So get ready for massive abundance. It's on the way. So thanks for watching rule number six, giving from my upcoming book, The Nine Money Rules Millionaires Use. I believe in you.